Hello my math loving friends. Today we are we will be solving a system of two equations. 1 plus x cubed plus 3xy is equal to y cubed. And the second equation is 1 plus x to the power of 5 is equal to y to the power of 5. And solving it is not easy. First, in the initial equation on this one, I move y cubed to the right hand side, resulting in x cubed minus y cubed plus 1 plus 3xy is equal to 0. We can apply the ID identity known as factorization of the sum of cubes in algebra, which states at a cubed plus b cubed plus c cubed minus 3abc is equal to a plus b plus c times a squared plus b squared plus c squared minus ab minus ac minus bc. I have another video that proves it, this identity. I will put the link to that video in the description. You can watch that one as well. Applying... Um, <clears throat> We can apply this identity, so uh, applying this identity, I rewrite the equation as x cubed plus minus y cubed plus 1 cubed minus 3x times minus y times 1. It means in our equation, a is x, b is minus y, and c is number 1. So this will be equal to a plus b plus c, which is x plus minus y plus 1, and then the rest of the identity, x squared plus minus y squared plus 1 squared minus x times minus y minus x times 1 and minus minus y times 1. I needed another parenthesis here. And now, utilize, uh, now we can uh, <clears throat> simplify this. And it will be x cubed minus y cubed plus 1 cubed plus minus negative and negative will be positive plus 3xy is equal to x minus y plus 1 times x squared plus y squared plus 1 squared plus xy minus x and plus y. <clears throat> from the first from the first equation we <clears throat> we know that the left hand side of this equation is equal to 0 it means that x cubed minus y cubed plus 1 cubed plus 3xy is equal to 0 so i can assume that the right hand side of this equation is also 0 therefore i can write down x minus y plus 1 times x squared plus y squared plus 1 plus xy minus x plus y is equal to 0. When we have two factors multiplied together resulting in 0, it implies that each individual factor should be set equal to 0. So I can write that x minus y plus 1 is equal to 0 or y is equal to x plus 1. We will retain this new equation for later use. From the second equation, if I replace y with x plus 1, I obtain 1 plus x to the power of 5 is equal to x plus 1 to the power of 5. Applying the Newton Hayyam Pascal binomial expansion formula, which states that a plus b to the power of 5 is equal to a to the power of 5 plus 5 times a to the power of 4 times b plus 10 times a to the power of 3 times b squared plus 10 times a squared times b cubed plus 5 times a times b to the power of 4 plus b to the power of 5. So I apply this formula to this 
x plus 1 to the power of 5. So we'll, I will have a 1 plus x to the power of 5 is equal to, second hand, x to, x to the power of 5 plus 5x to the power of 4 plus 10x to the power of 3 plus 10x squared plus 5x plus 1. <clears throat> Then um, I can eliminate this number one with this one and x to the power of five with this x, x to the power of five from both sides. Uh, and I will have five x to the power of four plus 10 x to the power of three plus 10 x squared plus five x is equal to zero. Now factor, uh, factoring out five x, we have 5x times x cubed plus 2x squared plus 2x plus 1 is equal to 0. Then replacing 2x squared with x squared plus x squared and 2x with x plus x. I will have, we get 5x times x cubed plus x squared plus x squared plus x plus x plus 1. So Instead of 2x squared, I write down these two, x squared plus x squared, and instead of 2x, I write down x plus x. <clears throat> Factoring x squared from uh, the first two terms and x from the third and fourth terms, we get 5x times x squared times x plus 1 plus x times x plus 1 plus x plus 1 is equal to 0. Finally, factoring out x plus 1, we obtain 5x times x plus 1 times x squared plus x plus 1 is equal to 0. Now we can proceed to solve this new equation, which is quite straightforward. When we have three factors, Multiply it together, resulting in zero. It implies that each individual factor should set equal to zero. I, um, it means that five, five x is equal to zero, or x plus one is equal to zero, or x squared plus x plus one is equal to zero. Five x is, is equal to zero means x is equal to zero. And because y is equal to x plus one, y is y is equal to 1 so this is the first set of answer for x and y which is 0 and 1 x plus 1 is equal to 0 it means as x is equal to minus 1 and if we put minus 1 here y will be 0 so second set of answers uh, se second set of answer will be for x and y will be mi minus 1 negative 1 and 0 then we should uh, solve this quadratic equation. The formula for solving a quadratic equation of ax squared plus bx plus c is equal to 0 is x is equal to minus b plus or minus square root of b squared minus 4ac over 2a. In our equation, a is 1, b is 1, and c also is 1. 1. So we get x is equal to minus 1 plus or minus square root of 1 squared minus 4 times ac. a is 1 and c is 1, 2. And uh, over 2a, two 2a two is, um, is 1, so it will be 2 times 1. And 1 squared is 1. And um, minus 4 times 1 times 1 will be minus 4. Then we will have minus 1 plus or minus square root of minus 3 over 2. Or we have x is equal to minus 1 plus or minus square root of 3 times minus 1 over 2. And I can separate these two. So I'll have minus 1 
plus or minus square root of 3 times square root of minus 1. The square root of minus 1 is a irrational, irrational number donated as i. So the two uh, roots of equation, the two other roots of equation will be minus 1 plus or minus square root of 3 times i over 2. And we know that y is equal to x plus 1. So I calculate y as minus 1 plus or minus square root of 3i over 2 plus 1. y 3 and 4 will be 1 plus or minus square root of 3i over 2. So x is minus 1 square root, uh, plus or minus square root of 3i over 2 and y is 1 plus or minus square root of 3i over 2. I hope you enjoyed the video. Your support would be greatly appreciated if you could give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and share it with your friends. Thank you so much. Wishing you a fantastic time wherever you are on this planet.